Hello and welcome back to Final Fantasy 13. This is part 6 of my view review. And we'll go all the way back to Yusnan to follow the story will lead us to Snow. I'm checking the situation now. It looks like the guards are so caught up in the confusion that the palace is wide open. It actually worked. To be honest, I had my doubts. It's all thanks to that director helping us out. If we'd set up the explosion as you'd planned it, that play would have been a real tragedy. Yes, I admit I might have miscalculated somewhat. But didn't you enjoy playing the leading role? Next time you go on stage. <laughs> Not in that costume. Light, you need to head for the palace's top floor. That's where you'll find Snow. He's heading for the throne of the Lassie. Okay, um, so leave here in this area. This area is inside the opposite side of the palace. Looking around this area, is a massive big soul section here. And there's a secret up if you go far to this corner. There's a spear right in the corner here. Um, not to worry, you can come back here later on if you do not um, collect that. But it's a pretty good item. In this case, some gil. Um, you'll come across in this courtyard the Cyclops. Pretty nasty beast again. The Cyclops you beat earlier. Um, I really showed you the Cyclops from previous. Um, the Cyclops you have to just use your attacks so and bear it down and um, just keep welling away at it with attacks. Um, any sort of thunder attacks will do. You can de shell, in this case, that's what I've done here, and that'll um, debuff the enemy and you can just well away at them. Um, if you get any sort of Debuffs like D shell, D protect, curse, etc. Poison. You could cast these on them and they will quite easily take this guy down. He's going to hit you with a club, so it's mainly just physical attacks if you want to protect against them. You might catch the evil eye, which is one of these more devastating attacks. If you can just guard against that, you should be alright. Not much, really much to go on here. Now, this story leads on from the other video where the fireworks display. After the fireworks display, I fell into the courtyard, and this is where we are kicking up from continuing the story in Yusnan. Now, well, the, the object, object of this level, um, this part of the story, is for me to get to the top of the tower. Getting to the top of the tower itself will get me a one on one shot against Snow, who I have to beat to save his soul. So. Kind of funny one. In this case, I've staggered the uh, successful managed just staggering them enough. Using Fundaga or Fire or one of these um, things ending in Aga, um, you should be able to cast them up into the air. And this happened to me some nasty, nasty blows near the end of his cycle itself. Don't get caught out when he does a lot of these attacks. He'll do it near the end when he's um, then about halfway. Watch out for these devastating physical attacks he does. He can bounce you up in there and stuff like that. So make sure your health's topped up. Um. Anyway, um, getting to getting to snow. We'll just go over in a wee minute once this boss fight is completed. It's um, going to be a tricky area inside the actual palace itself. Um, you're virtually inside um, a whole area full of chaos. And chaos will ramp up as you go higher up the tower. It's not like um, the area with Caius, where you're being cursed and you end up losing HP as you go through it. In this case, there's just going to be hard enemies. So if you do attempt to fight any um, on the way up to snow at the top of the tower, You'll be fighting them in hard, so it'll be pretty tough. They'll be pretty buffed up bosses. And clearly the Cyclops are just what they are. He was, um, that was the advanced Cyclops, because that was inside a Chaos Cloud. So if you can, just run away from fights. Um, it benefits you not to fight, unless necessary. Just a word of warning in that sort of aspect there. That one's okay, that one's not in the Chaos Cloud, but further up you will see the Chaos um, sections. This has got many floors, and you just got to go up each floor 
and a wee um, puzzle on each floor and you just um, do what it needs to get done to get to the next level because there's, um, there's gates and doors each gate and door has to be opened um, specifically so you have to just get to the point where you can get the gate open this is the chaos cloud I was referring to um, and you'll get this, these sort of chaos clouds all the way up so things it will just keep churning enemies at you so be wary of that one that's not the lift that's um, some seats <laughs> some of the puzzle platforming I was referring to. Like that. That's a good, it's a useful item there, it protects against um, nice stuff. This guy's got a lot of supplies, so uh, fill up and restock if need be, because um, this will be the one and only chance you're going to get before you fight against Snow. Alright, after his warning and your restock supplies, you go up the top and you'll come across this section here. So if you have a good search about um, the nearby area, you'll be able to you'll come across a room with some key items in it. Um, and say that room um, will be the item you'll need to break this ice shield on a stable. So upon getting Sarah's pendant, I'm coming to hear your side of the story. Did you just forget about the pendant? Your only memento of Sarah because you've thrown aside her love? Or did you leave it? You should go back to the main room. That's quite easy. You can drop down the gap in the floor and it'll drop you back into the, the passageway of the patrons.
You'll recognise this area as uh, that you went past previously, and that will take you back past the guard again. You can supply up if you get a chance or want to, and this will take you up to the actual gate point again. And prepare for battle, because this is the last option you're going to get before the major cutscene before the main fight. Can you hear me? But you locked yourself up in there because you thought it was what Cheryl would want. Think again. Or did you never really know her? The only thing she wanted was you. Don't you abandon her now. Don't deny her that wish. Power of Sarah's Pendant breaks the ice shield as expected. And this room is chock a block with chaos. Hey, it's the high and mighty savior. You here to bring God's judgment on me? Not like it worked for you before. It'll be different this time. You ready to listen to reason? Isn't that my line? Looking at this city, I'd begun to worry that you weren't the snow I once knew. But it looks like nothing will ever change you. Yeah, sorry about last time. I had to test you there. I didn't know you were the real one. Well, I left behind Sarah's pendant and sealed myself up in here. I figured that if you were an imposter, you'd never think to use a trinket to bust through that seal. But you knew exactly what that pendant was and what to do with it. sister but you understand like no one else does I bet you figured out as soon as you saw that room it's a prison a nice grave for a monster like me God how can there be this much chaos it's pretty hard to swallow huh the worst thing is it just keeps on growing all I can do to keep it contained so it doesn't spread. When I destroy this last infusion, that'll be the end of me. I'll be out of power. It seeks time. But I'm the patron. Part of the job, keeping everyone safe. <clears throat> Kept at bay all this time. You'll protect him, won't you? There's no need for me. Snow! Stay back! Let me through this. I'm tired of being useless. I'll find other use. I watched the world fall into chaos. I watched it die. I couldn't stop it. Don't you get that? Give me this last thing. Let me get it right just this once. Damn it. You're not trying to do the right thing. You're running away. You're looking for a way out. A death that's no different than suicide. How can you face Sarah after that? <clears throat> Nothing is going to change the fact that I swore to make Sarah happy. And instead, I couldn't even keep her from dying. I know I'll never see her again. Snow, stop this. This is what I deserve. I know it, and you know it. I mean, come on! Do your worst! <sighs> I'm sorry. you you've got to be kidding you you want me to be your sister then you say something like that you're asking too much snow you're asking me to kill well it takes you into the most craziest reason to have a fight <laughs> you've got to attack you guessed it your brother and kill him how stupid is this so, you go into this fight attacking Snow and want to save his soul, but except you've got to, like, kill him to do it. So, yeah. Any reason to have another fight against another Final Fantasy character? 
just like the same as you did with Noel, you've got to attack Snow as well in this case. So best objects to do here is Snow's going to attack you with a lot of ice powers, so protect against ice powers is essential. Um, debuffing as much as you can, you'll use a lot of physical attacks as well. As you know, Snow is the physical type, but he will attack you with um, quite a bit of ice powers. But if you use your main attacks, which is your lightning attacks, then it should be quite effective. Watch out for these key movements where he'll come at you. Like that. Mm, these are pretty, pretty nasty attacks if you're not defending properly. But as you can see here, Snow is virtually going down quite quickly. When you stagger him, just pummel away at him as quickly as you can. Give him a good couple of whacks and you'll find um, he'll go down quite quickly. If you've got some overclocks, stick them in. And bang, 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 you should find it should go down pretty effectively. Same again, if you got him down quite a bit, he'll use um, extra buffs. To make his attacks even stronger. But again, Snow, if you catch him in the early days when he's just Snow Villars um, and not Snow Villars Plus, then you do pretty well. Um, much like Noel, you have to actually beat this boss before day five. After day five, it will get a bit harder. But even then, after that, um, I wouldn't expect him to cause too much problem. There's a key one, again, there's a key, there's a key fight. You have to actually do this as part of the main quest. You have no choice no matter, you must defeat Snow. Um, losing this battle will put you back one hour, but you still need to actually do the battle again, so... Use whatever you can to break snow down. As you see, snow's all the B bus and bus have dropped off snow. That's the best opportunity to to get as many hits as you can in some. I've been handling them pretty effectively. Staggered again. In goes the overclock, slash, 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 slash. If you've got the Chaos Revenge blade, you can use that at this point. So there's a few other nice weapons you can use. This Cutlass, for example, pretty effective. Pretty effective blade. A couple more hits and it looks like Snow will be down. And with the defeat of Snow, it will trigger in the next cutscene. And while we're on this subject, this music for Snow is awesome. You can probably hear it in the background. The chaos, it's disappearing. Thing, isn't he? He swallowed up all that chaos and kept it at bay. He sacrificed himself to keep the city safe. And his only reward was to turn into a monster. How about you do him a favor? Do what he asked. That thing's not even him anymore. It's kinder to put it out of its misery. Yep, snow's gone. And you know what? The only hope for his soul lies in death. So that's it. Oh, that is good. I bet he became a thief right now because he wanted you to kill him. You know nothing about Snow. <gasps> <sighs> <laughs> you said you understood his pain, didn't you? <laughs> like, you know what the past 500 years were like. Every day blaming himself for Sarah. Trying to fix the world. 
He's been fighting to protect people while you snoozed away in a dream world. I bet he really was relieved that you decided to wake up and get back to the world of the living. I bet he thought he could finally put an end to his misery. He drew on every last bit of strength and threw himself into the darkness. So why don't you just set him free already? Don't you think that's what Sarah would want? You want to hide, eh? <laughs> I want to... I want to save you, make you free. But uh, I just don't know how. And this actually is really hard. Um, heartful Sarah moments in this one. Get your hand because she's out. If she was just here now, she'd find a way to reach and bring you back. We wish she was, and I can't be what she was. Snow, the only thing I can do is do what you asked of me. But please, don't let your feelings for Sarah disappear into the chaos. She never stopped believing in you. No matter how far away your journey took you, or how long you stayed apart, she thought she would be with you again! I know she still believes it now! Her soul is dreaming of being with you again right now, you stupid fool! If you're not here anymore, then what is my sister supposed to come home to? So you were selfie. I'm begging you. You tell me you've not got a hand here, but uh bring Sarah back. Wasn't that lovely? For a second there I thought you cared. so I can bring Sarah back. Oh, my good looks and charm aren't reason enough. Uh. Yeah, right. With that hair. <laughs> Damn it, Light. You always were a hard case. <sighs> I've spent how many centuries watching the world slip away from me? And even when I give everything I got to protect it, I don't get a single thanks. <laughs> So I finally say enough is enough. Look for a nice place to die, and you'll ruin that too. Sorry about that. Mm. You were forced to hold down the fort a long time. It was my fault. <laughs> you gonna make it up to me? Don't get too cocky. Listen, Snow. The world is ending, and soon there's no way for any of us to stop it. But don't give up. You've got to believe. Believe that even when this world ends, a new world will be born from the ashes. That's where we'll find hope again. It won't die with the world. I'll make sure of that. Trust me. I just need more time. I need you. I know, I know. To save the day. I'm on it, sis. I'm still the patron of you, Snan, right? You sure are hard with your friends, you know that? What if you killed me? We'd have trouble facing Sarah then. I knew you'd be fine. You're too stubborn to die. Take care of Sarah. Please, help her find her way back. Stay strong. Someday you'll be all she has. Well, when you put it like that, guess I got no choice but to do what I can. Sure, lightning says bring me back. But what 
Would you even want to come with me? I'm the guy who couldn't keep a single promise. Do you still want me, Sarah? Not like you can answer me. So do I just wait? No, I'm gonna bring you home. Like a real hero. Yep, Snow still thinks a hero. I think she's the star of the story. That completes the section of Yes Man main case and it's completed thusly. Join us next week for more Final Fantasy. I'll catch you next time. Like, subscribe and comment.